Can we get the one to go? White flag. There it is. Stenhouse leaving the second lane, going nowhere. It is Harvick and Chris Busher. What? Watch this run that Ty Dillon might be able to give to Ryan Blaney to give him a big run. Nope. Ty goes underneath. Blaney pokes out. Stenhouse is with him. Harvick got away from oh, Busher. Reckon. But up front, they're racing for the win. Blaney's ahead. is in the back, and Blaney is the leader. Stenhouse. Comes back to him on the bottom. Off turn four, three wide. Not over yet. Here comes Eric Jones. Nemechek trying to push Jones. Eric Jones with help. Here comes Almirola. Crash into the wall. I think it's Stenhouse. It might be Blaney. Oh, my goodness. They were, what, three, four wide? Slamming and banging. Almirola spun out, but he's in third position at the line. Great job there, Josh. Way to stay calm, collected. Scoring unofficial and under review. And Ryan Blaney wins Talladega. What a wild finish. Now, Ryan Blaney was able to side draft, get that run, get to the inside of the four. Here comes a huge run. John Hunter Nemechek to the rear bumper of Eric Jones, just shoving him to Ryan Blaney. Ryan Blaney goes from the top all the way to the bottom to try to block that run. More contact. Man, Stenhouse was so close to pulling ahead of Blaney. Wow. And look, look at the 10 car as he bounces at the, the line. line. <laughs> How about that? A lot of questions about what position do you want to be in? Do you want to be leading or in second? I think you have to be leading. There's always a wreck with one to go, and then the race is over. So I think Blaney's got to be in this position. Chase Elliott jumped out of line. That was his, likely his only opportunity is he's going to get almost three wide there with the 13. Tries to get front. help. He tries to get that help from Ty Dillon. Now, everyone fighting for every position. Down the back stretch for the final time. Ryan Newman. Newman. Huge push from Hamlin. Here comes Newman. Oh, Newman oh, sideways. Right now. He saved it. He saved it. That's going to give that 12 car a chance to get another run. But Newman way out front. They're going to have a big run coming up on this six car down the front straightaway. Huge here. block coming right here. Blaney as they go around the 37. Almost upside down. So is the 96. Parker Kligerman. Here they come. They make contact. They're side by side. It's a photo finish at the line. Blaney and Newman were side by side when they crossed the line. Unbelievable finish. Yes, we didn't beat regardless. Blaney, by just a foot, is going to get the win over Newman. <laughs> I think he felt like it might get a little crazy yep. here on this lap, last lap, and uh, Mark's usually pretty right. It's this is going to be a crowded house. Here comes Harvick, right up the back bumper of Jimmy Johnson. And there goes Kyle Busch in the 18 car, jump to the high side, he gets blocked, he goes back to the bottom. Jimmy Johnson doing what a whale of a job he's doing on those tires, stayed out. I think Boyer pushed Harvick right by him on the outside through three and four. Teammates. Two Chevys helping each other. Hey, have you ever seen this movie before? <laughs> uh, Here comes Harvick. Ago. Don't count Jimmy Johnson Jimmy out. Johnson's Ooh. fighting back. Here they come. Not over yet. Check Who is it in the air. Jimmy Johnson. Johnson. Johnson got it. I mean. By inch. Six one thousandths of a second. That's what I said, an inch. With no fresh tires on that race car. Good call, Chad Canals. Unofficially for the transfer uh, spot. Let it go. <laughs> I didn't know it was over. I was still going. Like... <laughs> How close do you want it? Harvick John. tried to get that side draft <laughs> yeah. off of him. Jim, he actually sucked Jimmy Johnson around. You can see the back of the car swing around just a tad. But uh, he made it. Wow. What great camera work. What a finish. Right there. There's the that. difference. Instead of Harvick by inches. 
It's Johnson by inches. Now, further back. Here Gordon. they go for two in a row, trying to set him up. Gordon's going to make the big move on the inside when they get down here to turn three. Haas, slow car might be in the way. Here he comes. He's going to drive it to the bottom. Oh, Harvick's leaving a lot of bottom open. Oh, this slow car. Slow car. Slow car's going to be in the way. Just That's like a year ago. He's going to get him, though. Here he's going to get him. Gordon's got to lose it. Harvick. Harvick by inches. Harvick by inches. Harvick by inches. What a race. How what a finish. How did Jeff Gordon hang on to that car? That loose off turn four. Man. Tell me if we got him. Tell me if we got him. 29 car. You got him, buddy. Harvick, you got him. Six one thousandths of a second. Nice job. Look at this. Man. For the win. That is ever so six one thousandths of a that second. Is. A replay of a year ago with Dale Earnhardt and Bobby Labonte. That's an incredible finish. What a job for that young man. They finish. Two Chevys, two Toyotas, two Dodges, two Toyotas, a Chevy and a Toyota. But on point, Jeff Burton trying for his first Daytona Speed Week's checkered flag. Clint Boyer locked on to him. I know Michael and, and, and Kyle would like to pull out, but they're afraid to. Too wide behind them with Brian Keselowski in fifth. They're going to take a look here, Michael and, and Kyle. Here they come. They got to run, but they're going to crash. Oh, no. Trevor Bain is in it along with David Reagan. Yeah. Whoa! Burton will win it oh, over break. Boyer. Five one thousandths of a second. A thrilling finish, but in more ways than one, as they got three, maybe four abreast up in turn number four. What a shame for the 21 car. Yes. Burton's a winner. Chicken dinner. He's going to be in the gas all the way. I don't care how sideways this thing gets. Last right lap. Here. And, he needs, your help. and, and he needs brother. to be because if they wreck right. right now, he's got to be the first guy across that loop. And Kyle Busch now has his brother Kirk behind him. The one thing is Kyle Busch has the inside. And because of where the start finish line here is at, at this place, the inside line is the line if you can maintain it coming out of turn four. Will well, Edwards, oh man, I'll tell you what. Will Edwards help his teammate or will he Just make a move out. for the keep win? Your brother will come show. Uh, I don't I don't know if he'll be able to make the move for the win. Kyle Bush is the guy right here. He's yep, the winner. He's gonna he's gonna have the momentum and he's gonna get to the line. Coming to the checkers. Oh wow! Oh, that was close. I don't know. I Wait for scoring. I think the 26 got him. It says 26 on the monitor. But, wow, great. My God. What an incredible finish. It does not get any, I don't know who, I, like I said, that was incredible. I would have bet all the money in the world Kyle Busch had that thing when he came out of turn four. NASCAR is gonna look at the video. The 26 surged right there, right at, right the, line. at the line. It's, it's like the truck series races that we've seen here in the past. You are the man! Where you think? Jamie McMurray has won the Pepsi 400. Good job, guys! Man, that was, it does, I mean, that was great. That's incredible. Watch the 26 just get a surge right before the line. It's his teammate right behind him, Carl Edwards. Right there, the five had the advantage. And he had the momentum. And here they are. And you see Now watch right here. Right there. You see it start to move again. Remember the finish in the 500? <laughs> How about that? That is That's good a, stuff. That's incredible. Jamie McMurray replaced Sterling Marlin after Sterling was injured in a crash. He won his second career start, but has not had much success. He changed teams, he went to Roush, he's gone 166 races without a win until this moment, just seconds ago. Here they come. Urban on the inside. The shortcut on the inside is gonna be of some help. As they come to the line, dead even. I don't know, I think like the three. I think Earnhardt won the race. He was off the close. Give it to Earnhardt. Dale Earnhardt has done it again at Talladega. How'd you win it? By a couple inches. <laughs> he really is. You know, it was a tough day. Uh, man, it's close racing all day long. We're lucky. Junior. Oh, gee. Uh-oh, boys. They're going to run out of racetrack. 
Got to give him some room, Mike. Earnhardt Jr. muscled his way to the front. They're lining up for a run behind him. Here comes Jeff Burt. This is it. They all make it back without wrecking him. Surprise me, boys. Two by two. Earnhardt on the bottom. Skinner up top to squeeze him down. Photo finish. Photo finish. I will not try to call that. We was looking right down on him. Skinner just back from his honeymoon. Man. His wife thinks they've won. Bernhardt Jr.'s crew think they've won. They're one pit apart from each other. I'm going to put my money on Skinner. Unofficially, by four one thousandths of a second, Mike Skinner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Unbelievable finish. Wow. And the transfer spot goes to Ricky Rudd. Here we come. Here they come. Want to be on the outside, right? Just a, oh, just a little Look back bit. here. We still got another one back here. There's group will they go with, and will here it help the Jumbo's cars, or will it help Jeff Gordon to victory lane? All bets are off. They get to the middle of the triangle. Watch out, down low. Way Good down run. comes Johnson. Good run. He's got room. They're three wide. Three by three to the line. Johnson. Maybe Jimmy Johnson. I believe he got him by an inch. Two one thousandths of a second he beat Boyer. Okay, a sixteenth of an inch. Have you ever? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. No, we have I never. I have never Everybody. seen anything like that. Woohoo! Jeff Gordon watching Boyer, seeing if he can beat Boyer. Left just enough room on the inside for Johnson and Earnhardt. Right there in the trioval, it's Boyer's race. Yeah, it looks like Boyer's pulling ahead, but then all of a sudden they hit that air, that wall of air. Here comes that 48. But Darrell, the start finish line here is a thousand feet further. And look how close it is. Four wide at the wire. That is just a beautiful thing right there. Two, four, six, eight cars. So close, we can hardly capture it with our stop motion camera. There's a look at it, and there is the margin. I'm gonna try to slide under him here. Come on, baby. And Blaney's coming. And both these cars are driving terrible right now. Not nah. allowed to go. Nah, they're driving good. Come on, baby. You can do it on this end of the speedway. Come off the board and get up alongside of him. Half a mile. Here he gone. comes. Here he comes. Who's going to get off? Here he comes. Here he comes. He's got him this time. It's going to be a drag race. Wow. They touch. They touch. Craven got him. Craven got him. Craven got him. And Craven. All right. What a finish. Have you ever? No, I've never. Wow. Uh, what a finish. That's one great race. I'm going to tell you, it's the coolest race I've ever seen at Darling. Scott Miller gets his first win as a crew chief. Pontiac gets a win. Kyle Wells' engine program gets a win. First year for that engine program. And for the fifth time in Darlington history, a race is settled with a last lap pass. <laughs> we didn't have a last lap pass for no, the last yeah, year. That's, <laughs> that's the end of that. <laughs> that was a last at the start finish line pass there. What a I got to see this again. I do too. Let's, let's watch. Coming off turn four onto the front stretch. That's about as close as it'll get right there. And this right here, I don't know what kept them from both wadding them up down here in turn t uh, turn one, but bam, oh boy, Craven really shot out into it. It is amazing they didn't wreck after they crossed the start finish line. Daryl, if instead of Bush coming down into Craven, if he stays straight, does he beat Craven? I don't think he had any choice, Mike, because Craven came off the bottom and really slammed into him. I think they got hooked together and couldn't get apart. Look at Craven in there. Look at him fighting that steering wheel. And That's it's a, a good thing that Pontiac's got the kick out on the nose. Yeah, that was the difference. <laughs> but he wouldn't have won. Look at how close this finish is. Oh. Right there. Wow. <laughs>